But you'd like to know the discussions off air here before the Susan Collins bit. I'm like, can you play WAP? He's like, no, I can't. (laughs) I can't play WAP. Wouldn't have been funnier, right? Funnier. Susan Collins was dancing to WAP. I don't even doing key bumps. I don't think there's a radio friendly version of WAP. Probably not. Mm -hmm. Okay. You know what? At this point, I don't know why we should follow any of these rules because apparently, if we somebody, if we can pull together our money and have enough money, we don't have laws applied to us. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that was from my Where's last keyboard. It's going to be a little light. It's going to be a little light. Uh, all right. This. Hello. So the Collins is a freak in the bed, is killing me. <laughs> What's your point? It's killing me. Fred she, she, she prefers being a freak in the bed to the song WAP, but. We couldn't do All that. Right. So, well, okay. Yes. Okay. She loves the song WAP. Yeah, I know wow. you do. All no, no. 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 Uh, Susan, Susan Collins. Collins oh, does. Susan Collins yeah, does. She absolutely um, loves it. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I heard that she was actually, it's really about her. But yeah. I don't yes. Know. Oh, come on now. <laughs> <laughs> Angela, you're right, though. I said it earlier. I'm like, this has got to be like the one thing Madison Cawthorn's ever told the truth about yeah. because it's like, yes. yeah, it's a little too specific. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 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 Way too specific, but hysterical, and I think it. <laughs> mm-hmm. um, okay. I think it's a more boring thing than a Republican orgy, to be honest. I right? Really can't. Oh, oh, my God. Yeah. Yeah. Chuck Grassley at an orgy. Yeah, the Ugh. safe words are all like oh. racial and homophobic slurs. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, uh, no. For Angela, uh, I, okay, so I don't, how many, you're here a day early this week because you're busy tomorrow, but how many felonies have we discovered in the how do we stop normalizing what is happening i i so much criming i don't even know if you want to weigh in on one particular thing well i personally think it takes a special kind of stupid audacity to be suing hillary clinton for <laughs> saying you were a russian puppet while asking russia to help you right now <laughs> while russian tv is calling you a right. puppet basically yes right yeah, I think, you know, the that's word, a, the word, the word again was doing a lot of heavy yes. lifting on Russian uh-huh. television this week. We would like to uh, have our partner, Donald Trump, in office, help him again. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that yeah. seems right. Yeah, that seems, I don't know, important. Um, to me? Let's talk about Ginny and Clarence Thomas. Now, <laughs> <laughs> I, okay, because I keep saying, Jody, what, this is not about recusal from a future thing he's already done the the corrupt thing that's right i mean what how is there a more clear conflict of interest than you are the only supreme court justice that ruled to withhold the records that you know include your wife's texts about overthrowing the government right yeah 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 that you you've done the you've done the thing the horses drank the milk already yeah what's amazing to me though is the reason that he got away with that vote at the time was because we all know he's stupid enough to not know the law so we all thought well he doesn't know the law to clarence thomas so but no <laughs> so i didn't suspect that there was a motive behind it behind besides his ignorance yeah right yeah well can i just say the exploding comedy cigar at the end of that tunnel is going to be when uh, the supreme court overrules interracial marriage yeah. i'm just saying yeah. mm-hmm. that's that's going to be well, funny it's wrong. It Pardon? Is wrong i mm-hmm. think we all know it's wrong <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I was. I did check my. I uh, think out of a paper calendar. It is 2022, and we decided that lynching finally bad. Lynching bad. And that lynching is okay. Is is not okay. And that black women's hair can be black women's hair. <laughs> I mean, it's ridiculous. not at the Oscars. Not at the Oscars. Though. That's right. Not at the Oscars. <laughs> Well, you know we had to we, we had to we had to wait and ask you about the slap. You know the funny thing about the slap is Donald Trump has also proven to have tried to overturn the United States government this week. But somebody slapped somebody, and uh, and you were saying, Francis, earlier that we uh, that we found out the Academy did ask him to leave. Yes, and yeah, he didn't. He so, refused. Yes, as happens with black people all over the world. That was the end of that. Just okay, right. fine. Mm-hmm. I cannot. I am so sick of rich people getting every day. I feel like all we're being confronted with is if you have wealth and access, thank you. There are laws that apply to you. Yes. In this case, justice, not black or white. It's green. Right. Yeah. Because he's a rich guy. It's like, wow. Oh, okay. You don't want to leave. That's fine. Then we'll just, you know. And, And I have to say that somebody somewhere, somehow there needs to be charges brought against him. I'm not asking for him to go to jail, Yeah. but I, I, there's a fine because at the end of the day, we were all assaulted. 
Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I mean, you know, I was yeah, whatever the crime, whatever the punishment is, he needs to get. That's called yeah. everybody I mean, subject to this. Pause. And comedians, all of us that have been on tour together, we're like, hey, wait a minute now. <laughs> <laughs> this is not a good precedent. But, yeah. Hey, there was a comedic crime pre-slap. <laughs> <laughs> like, Chris Rock would have received a ticket from the comedy community for a 25-year-old reference. Right. I mean, when you're is <laughs> that people who are up for awards weren't born for. Right. But yeah. it wasn't a good joke to begin with. Okay, I'm know? offended because my references are generally older than that. But okay, what's your point, Angela? Go ahead. <laughs> That and then also the fact is that Chris Rock did a documentary on black hair. Right. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. And he did. A do- he doesn't get to say he doesn't know that that cuts. He doesn't know how deeply that hurts because he did a documentary on it. Just, so, right. What he uh, did. What he did was illegal. What well, Will Smith. You know, Chris Rock's what, joke yeah. not good. But Francis, did you hear? I don't know whether that someone said did Chris Rock not know about her alopecia. I don't. I don't know. It, it, I don't, you know what? It doesn't matter. I haven't heard. He hasn't spoken about it. Yeah. But at the end of the day, also, I have to say this too. We all know all the you know the whispering about Jada Pinkett's uh, and Will Smith's uh, sexuality. Yeah. Uh, and and I and for me the 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 comment went deeper the joke went deeper than um it was a joke about her sexuality it was a a joke about him you know supposedly being you know i don't know if i could say the word uh but uh if i can't play wap no you cannot say whatever you're (laughs) thinking of but uh but but also you know it's it's it's, you know it's that 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 in black culture having your hair look like that you know what he's saying is is that you look like a lesbian yes that's exactly what that was oh i didn't catch that okay and i'm I'm a giant les saying was that you're ugly and that and then within black culture and mask being mask mm-hmm. being compared to being being saying that, that said that you're masculine mm-hmm. is an insult i see i totally missed that i mean and i was saying yeah, like he, yeah i mean a medical talking about a medical condition not cool but i you know i also was saying there are also degrees it's not cancer it's not someone going no. oh your wife has one boob huh you know i mean no. it's, it's so i don't know i mean i just yeah go ahead a pain pain is pain Pain is pain. Yeah. And like when you're, when something hurts you, there's no way to compare. We do this a lot. I think in our culture, we compare pain to pain. We go, oh, well, this isn't the Holocaust. Or this isn't that. Right. Pain is pain. And yes, there's hyperbole. But the reality is whether or not he knew specifically about Jada Pinkett's condition, Chris Rock, what he did know was that that wasn't funny. The reference was too old. Yeah. There was no pain saying. And I do believe there was a homophobic uh, slur in there. But all that being said, he not only does he have the right to say that, you just don't get to hit people. Yeah. And, or, we don't. And no, I just, we don't. the reality of assault is Chris Rock doesn't have to press charges. It's not up to the victim to do that. These are crimes against the state. They can press charges. The DA can press charges against Will Smith without him. And if yeah. Will Smith had anybody around him who could tell him what to do correctly, yeah. I would go to the police station and turn myself in and demand that they give me, punish me to show my family and my children and children all over this country that nobody is above the law. And yeah. that what I did was wrong. Yeah. I mean, what a lesson for your kids, right, Francis, in front of yeah. the largest audience in the world. That's all, what do you teach him? That hitting's not okay. Just yeah, the whole world you, you hit hit someone you and know, you sit down and then you get applauded and, and you get an award. And Jaden tweets, "That's how we do it in our family." Yep, mm-hmm. that's exactly what he tweeted. Yeah, it, it is. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Well, I okay. I don't. What do you make of like Tiffany Haddish uh, defended uh, Will Smith? You know Smith. what? This is this is what I'm going to say. We are all on a journey of enlightenment and understanding. Where she is and her understanding of, you know, men, of, up, yes, a lot of things is not necessarily she's on her own road. Mm-hmm. I'm going to say I don't agree with that. Yeah. I believe that it's 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 toxic <clears throat> that thinking that you he took away his wife's agency. Yep. Her ability to respond to it and speak her own words to her issue, her her strengths. Her whatever, however she felt about it, yeah. she doesn't get to talk about it. Well, and I he understand the words that, out her mouth too. Listen, I there's this famous story. You've already told it. You can't take it back now. Uh, remember who was? Where was it? Was it in college? Was it where college. someone called you the N word? Remember and the guy punches the guy. Oh on the gosh, cross. yes, it was like the best yeah. one of things ever happened to me. We were in the diagonal, me and a friend of mine talking at University of Michigan. 
And this guy just came up just swearing and yelling and he's using the N-word, calling me that. And, and then out of nowhere, I mean, I don't know where he came from. This white guy comes up or he appeared to be white and just clocks him. Like one punch knocks the man out. The, the racist is on the ground. We were just like, and my panties fell off. You admitted <laughs> to the losing of your panties over that. That's all I'm saying. And it's, if we're going to say violence is never okay, but I'm just saying <laughs> I... And right. there is a thing in women that, you know, I mean, I, I will yeah. admit to it, too, and I'm gay. But anybody that, like, protects you or stands up for you. Yeah. So there is a line there. That's what Tiffany Haydish was saying. Like, oh, if all our men stood up for us like this. But where do you draw the line at where that's a felony? She right. also supports a dictator. But the point is <laughs> that, that, like, I, I think that the reality is, it, as somebody who's considered and who thinks of themselves as a strong person... Uh, and also a strong black woman. Yeah, it is nice to have support. Yeah, it is nice to not always have to defend myself. But none of that matters. The re all of the rest of this is all of this around this is opinion and feeling. But there was an actual crime committed. Yeah, yeah. that is the thing that we don't have to agree or disagree about. There's law on it. Like yeah. just arrest him and charge him. Yeah. Show us for once that this law that laws apply to everyone. Like I'm sick of it. All right. Well, you can help Angela V. Shelton. And what I want you to do, I want you to march yourself back to that University of Michigan. You get your panties and you put them back on. <laughs> Whore. I looked for that man for for years. All right. Yeah. <laughs> it, ru it ruined my GPA trying to find him. Cause I was like, where's the man? The panties falling man. <laughs> <laughs> Ow, 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 ow,